Hello and welcome to the Amy Howard at Home Paintathon. My name is Tracy. I am with Tracy Luno Vintage Revive Design and Decor. Be sure to let us know where you're watching from. Tag three friends in the comments and you'll be entered in a drawing to win some miracle paint. This paint is fabulous, guys. I am in sunny Pensacola, Florida, and I am redoing a client's bathroom. I'm going to be demonstrating today the new one hour miracle paint on her vanity. This paint is fabulous. There's no priming, no sanding, no stripping, no top coat. It's just paint and done. So let's get started. Starting with a clean surface is your first step in refinishing a project. I won't make you watch me clean the vanity, but just know Amy's clean slate is perfect at removing any dust, debris, oil, waxes, anything like that that was used on the piece prior. This will remove that and allow for better adhesion of your paint. I'm going to be using Amy's inch and a half synthetic brush to do the project. Um, you can roll it on, you can spray it on, but I just find that the details in the vanity, it's going to allow for better coverage with the, with the synthetic brush. And I love these brushes, they're great. Before I get started, I wanted to talk about the Miracle Paint and why I chose it for the vanity instead of the One Step. The One Step paint gives you more of a flat surface and for the bathroom or for kitchen areas like that, you would need to put a top coat on it for um, cleanup and just everyday use. The Miracle Paint all I have to do is use the clean slate and two, two to three coats and the primer, the paint, and the top coat is all in it. So it's going to save me time and money. And it's going to look fabulous too. Let's get started. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. This paint. Oh. I think I heard someone say that um, they described it as going on like butter and I totally agree just it is just gliding over with this synthetic brush like butter I love that I don't have to sand it I don't have to Prime it. Uh, I do need to be careful with my paint application. And I'm not going to have to seal it with a top coat. I mean, paint and done. That is a miracle. Y'all, this color, it's called Aviary Blue. I think that was the hardest part about this entire bathroom remodel was picking out the color for the vanities. But we have picked a good one. Oh, this paint is fabulous. just going in the direction that the grain would have been.
this, um, the Miracle Paint has got UV protection in it too, so you can use it to paint your uh, front doors. Um, your Amy said that she painted her back, her her grill, her her uh, metal grill. And it's self-leveling, so I'm not going to have to worry about brush strokes. This is truly a miracle. I hope you can see just how <laughs> smoothly just going back and catching a little run that I had there. y'all can see this. I'm definitely going to take some pictures um, at the end and let you see the final result of the renovation. It's definitely um, a different consistency than the the one step paint. It's a little bit thinner, I would say, but this it, it's it's a thick paint still. It's very thick paint. Okay, we've got the fronts of the cabinets painted and on the doors I have got the hardware off of them and I have gotten them all clean slated and we are ready for the first coat. Here we go. Okay. Started painting these doors. So there's no wood grain on these doors actually, but I'm just following the direction that the wood grain would have been in and just painting all in one direction and getting a thin, just one thin coat on here. <clears throat> The um, fronts of the cabinets have dried, and y'all, it is just so pretty. <laughs> I can't wait for you to see the finish finished result of the bathroom and it's going by so quickly just having two little steps to do clean and paint it's going by so quickly it's saving so much time and I know time is valuable to us all Okay. <clears throat> 
<clears throat> Just that quick, I am almost done with the first coat of this door. careful of that. Get a smooth, even coat on there. That's the word I was looking for. One nice, even coat. And it'll be dry to the touch, I've noticed, in about 30 minutes. But I really like to... Uh-oh, I'm about to lose it here. I really like to wait about um, two hours or so before I go in with that second coat. I should have put some gloves on. If you're worried about your nails, you might want to wear some gloves. getting it in real time guys and just how quickly and easily you can transform your bathroom vanities as well or your kitchen cabinets or your front door or your floors or your grill or your furniture
this is the last door on the first vanity. There are there are actually three vanities in this bathroom. I've got two in here now and one on the way. I don't know if y'all will get to see the the third one before the um, video goes live or not, but at least you guys are getting to see just how quickly, easily, and beautifully you can transform your bathroom vanities as well. Or your kitchen, or your kitchen cabinets, or your floors, or your front door, or your grill, or your furniture. There's just so much to do with this paint. It is truly miracle paint. We love it. And with all the new colors, there's a lot of new um, pretty blues in the kitchen uh, cabinet line. There are over a hundred colors. Oh, so pretty. I hope that you're inspired to get started and redo your your own kitchen cabinets or bathroom vanities. I just hope you're inspired to do something, paint something, because you will really be impressed with this paint if you try it. Another coat down on the doors. And that aviary blue is so pretty. Oh, love it. I want to take a quick second and thank Amy and Jean Howard, as well as the entire staff at Amy Howard at Home for allowing me to participate in this year's paint on. I have thoroughly enjoyed it. Thank you for watching today. I hope you've been inspired to maybe transform your own bathroom vanity. I also hope that you will hop over to my page. I am on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, TikTok, or you can visit my website at tracyleno.com. Okay, I won't keep you any longer. Here's the reveal. <laughs>